Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to resolve the Mozilla Firefox error message that the Firefox network protocol has failed error, that Firefox has experienced a network protocol violation that cannot be repaired, the page you are trying to view cannot be shown because an error in the network protocol was detected. Please contact the website owners to inform them of this problem. So this should hopefully be a pretty straightforward process here, guys. And without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into it. So if you're experiencing this issue with only one particular website, then it's certainly an issue that you may want to just consider, you know, not doing anything about. It might have to do with the website itself. Now, if all of your websites you're browsing come across this network issue, I'm going to show you guys how to hopefully resolve that on your end. And without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into it. So first things first, if you have Firefox open, just go ahead and close out of it and then relaunch it. See if that resolves the problem. Something else you may also want to consider here as well, open up the search menu, type in CMD, best match, should come back with command prompt, right click on it and select run as administrator. If you receive a user account control prompt, select yes. And now into this elevated command line window, type in IP config followed by a space forward slash flush DNS. Flush DNS should all be one word attached to that forward slash out front. Hit enter on your keyboard. Should come back with Windows IP configuration. Successfully flushed the DNS resolver cache. Now you want to go ahead and type in NETSH space WinSock. W-I-N-S-O-C-K space reset. Once again, exactly how you see it on my screen. Hit enter. Should come back, we'll have successfully reset the WinSock catalog. You must restart the computer in order to complete the reset. At this point, you want to go ahead and close out of here and then restart your computer. And then hopefully, again, you should have been able to resolve the problem at this point. If you are still experiencing an issue, you can open up the search menu and search for Firefox. Best result, should come back with Firefox. Go ahead and open that up. And give it a moment. Select the menu icon up at the top right corner of the browser screen. Just go ahead and left click on it. On the right side, you want to select where it says Settings. In the Find in Settings option, you want to click in, inside of here and type in Cache. Where it says clear data, go ahead and select that. Make sure cached web content is checkmarked as well as cookies and other site data. You may want to optionally consider that. You can checkmark it. However, you might get signed out of websites if cleared, so you will have to enter back in your login credentials if you have some websites automatically save them. Generally, it's not even a really good idea to have your passwords saved on websites in the browser because your browser can be vulnerable to that. But regardless, you know, that's a different topic for another day. But I'm going to keep both of them checkmarked here and select clear. And selecting clear now will clear all cookies and site data stored by Firefox. This may sign you out of websites and remove offline web content. Select clear now. And now just close out of Firefox. Relaunch Firefox and then attempt to access the website domain you were having the problem with before. And hopefully your issue should have been resolved. So, as always, thank you guys for watching this brief tutorial. I do hope I was able to help you out, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.